Hello and welcome to this video where I'm going to be showing you how to add a border to a photo in Canva. It's very easy to do and if you'd like to follow along I will leave my link in the description where you can use Canva for free or simply use that for easier login access. So make sure when you do this that you have a PNG photo. What that means is that the background is going to be transparent. If you don't have one of those and say you know like there was white in the background it's going to be a shadow around everything. So that's going to be the difference of why a PNG or just a transparent photo is going to be better. So when we have our photo let's click on it. Let's go to edit image and from there let's scroll down ever so slightly until we get to shadows. Let's click on see all and from here we can pick anyone we want. So this is going to be like the border around it but obviously glow is going to be the best here right. So let's do glow here and what we can also do is click on the gear right here to change this around. So color you know we have a border we probably want it to be not as blurry right so the more blurry you do uh, like obviously it's not going to be as nice of a border so we can make that much smaller and also make the size much bigger so you'll notice how it, it gets bigger this way we also have transparency so if we want to make it kind of almost invisible or we can make it much darker so this is going to be like more of the natural border the darker you go that way and you can also change around the size so this is where you just want to play around with it ever so slightly you know i'd probably change the color too just because it like goes into the hair and it's kind of hard to see there so if we were changing colors you know what would we want to use based on the background maybe something like this see that makes it pop a little bit more nevertheless that's where you can mess around with it and i think that looks pretty good but that's how you can add a border to a photo in canva very easy to do and if you have any questions at all feel free to leave a comment down below and i'll do my best to help sometimes i know the answer sometimes i don't but nevertheless my name is james thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video